In the complex world of personal finance, we often face tough choices about saving, spending, paying bills, investing, and preparing for emergencies. It can feel overwhelming, like being lost at sea. But in the midst of this financial turmoil, Warren Buffett, known as the Oracle of Omaha, stands out as a reliable source of financial wisdom. With a long history as an investor and a net worth exceeding $100 billion, he's a master of wealth building. Today, we'll explore eight key principles from Warren Buffett to help you plan your financial journey. Financial management is full of challenges, making it hard for even the most determined individuals to get rich. We constantly struggle to find the right balance between immediate satisfaction and long-term security. Distinguishing between safe and risky investments is a perpetual dilemma, and creating a budget that doesn't feel too restrictive is a common challenge. Getting out of debt can be tough too, as the allure of immediate pleasures often leads to overspending, leaving us with insufficient funds by the end of the month. However, it's precisely during these financial struggles that Warren Buffett's proven principles can provide essential guidance. They help us not only survive the financial storm, but also navigate it gracefully. Here are eight principles to follow after you've received your income. Principle number one, prioritize savings. Buffett's initial principle, elegantly encapsulated in his adage, do not save what is left after spending, but spend what is left after saving, calls for a substantial shift in our approach to finances. Typically, we view savings as the meager crumbs remaining after indulgent expenditures. However, Buffett urges us to diverge from this perspective. He staunchly asserts that the process of establishing savings should take precedence, with spending following suit. This shift compels us to ingrain regular savings as an indisputable priority, irrespective of our income level. Importantly, it emphasizes the significance of prioritizing our future financial well-being, safeguarding us from future resource scarcity as retirement approaches. The initial step in translating this concept into action involves promptly setting aside a designated sum of money upon its deposit into our bank accounts. This amount should be regarded as an unwavering financial commitment, akin to fixed expenses like rent or utilities. Principle number two, build an emergency fund. Warren Buffett places considerable emphasis on the paramount importance of creating a rainy day fund. He underscores that the combination of capital and resilience during crisis moments is truly invaluable, underscoring their mutual significance. This goes far beyond the fundamental establishment of a financial safety net designed to shield us from life's unpredictable curveballs. It entails the essential task of equipping ourselves with the necessary resources to capitalize on unforeseen opportunities that may arise amid such upheaval. Events such as job loss, unexpected health emergencies, or unanticipated house repairs exemplify occurrences that can significantly disrupt our financial stability, all of which are inherent facets of life's capricious journey. Establishing a contingency savings account serves as a robust financial defense mechanism, effectively safeguarding us against unexpected adversities. It fosters the self-assurance required to navigate the often tumultuous waters of the financial realm, thus averting hasty, panic-driven decisions. Commencing this journey entails taking initial steps, including setting aside an adequate amount of funds to cover a month's living expenses, with a gradual augmentation to ensure it can sustain us for a minimum of six months. Principle number three, creating a budget. Budgeting represents a cornerstone within any prudent financial strategy and warrants deliberate attention. Buffett ardently asserts that acquiring unnecessary items in haste may inexorably lead to the necessity of parting with essential possessions, a wisdom derived from his own experiences. This eloquent declaration notably underscores the potential consequences stemming from unrestrained spending. A budget, far surpassing its function as a mere financial ledger, emerges as a meticulously crafted route map steering us resolutely toward our fiscal objectives. It facilitates the crucial differentiation between our desires and needs, thereby shielding us from squandering hard-earned resources. Concurrently, it serves as a reflective mirror, casting light on the destinations of our financial resources. The intent is not to impose a frugal existence, but rather to empower ourselves with the knowledge required for judicious financial decision-making. Pursuing financial stability need not entail sacrificing life's pleasures. 
The inaugural step on this path involves devising a spending plan that accommodates our aspirations in this sphere while allowing room for enjoyment. Principle number four, paying off debt. Buffett imparts concise counsel in response to the pressing predicament of debt, succinctly advising that when ensnared in a financial pitfall, the paramount imperative is to cease further digging. This succinct admonition underscores the critical nature of liberating ourselves from the clutches of burdensome debt, which can relentlessly drain our resources, particularly when it comes to high interest debts. Eliminating debt entails putting a halt to this kind of financial bleeding and laying a foundation for wealth accumulation. Commencing this endeavor involves creating an inventory of all existing debts, with the primary objective centered on settling those obligations burdened with the highest interest rates. Employing strategies such as the debt snowball or debt avalanche, along with consulting financial experts, represents viable avenues. The ultimate objective of freeing oneself from financial obligations extends beyond mere financial self-sufficiency. It aspires to emancipate us from the perpetual specter of anxiety. Principle number five, investing. Buffett fervently advocates for the practice of investment, stressing the importance of allocating a minimum of 20% of our income for this specific purpose. His philosophy finds is well expressed in the sentence, someone sitting in the shade now because someone planted a tree a long time ago, which ranks among his most renowned quotes, investing in the stock market can be likened to sowing the seeds of a prosperous future. It involves harnessing the power of compounding, transforming our capital, into a productive asset capable of generating greater wealth than its initial value. For beginners in the investment realm, it is sensible to commence with low-risk options. As one gains both self-assurance and expertise, the door opens to exploring a diverse array of investment opportunities. Key principles encompass the imperative of staying well-informed, cultivating patience, and acknowledging that investment is a long-term endeavor. Principle number six, creating a spending plan. Buffett's approach to budgeting closely aligns with his belief that safeguarding control over our time necessitates the ability to say no, resisting external influences that seek to dictate our life's course. This concept highlights the importance of implementing a well-structured spending plan, serving as the driving force propelling us toward our financial goals. Such a plan ensures the wise allocation of resources, shielding us from the allure of impulsive purchases that can divert us from our intended path. Getting started with this process involves describing our monetary objectives and aligning our resource allocation with these goals, all while maintaining a healthy equilibrium between satisfying essential needs and fulfilling our aspirations. Building flexibility into the plan accommodates adjustments in response to evolving personal and professional circumstances. Principle number seven, always retain cash. Regarding the importance of preserving liquidity, Buffett firmly holds that cash plays a role akin to oxygen for an individual, often taken for granted when it's abundant, but becoming the sole focus when it's in short supply. Just like how we don't think much about breathing until we're gasping for air, the same goes for cash. Having liquid assets at your disposal serves as a financial safety net, providing the flexibility needed to handle unexpected costs and seize unexpected opportunities. While investing your money is crucial, Going all in on investments can leave you financially vulnerable when unexpected expenses hit. That's why it's essential to always maintain a certain level of liquidity in your financial arsenal. Principle number eight, outsourcing. Warren Buffett, a staunch advocate of focusing on your strengths over weaknesses, encourages the delegation of tasks outside your expertise. In his perspective, the distinction between successful individuals and those achieving true success lies in the latter's adeptness at confidently declining most commitments. As articulated in his book and numerous discussions, when you opt to outsource certain tasks, you effectively free up your valuable time and resources, enabling you to allocate your efforts toward activities that yield the most significant returns on your investments. This principle extends seamlessly to the realm of finance, particularly in areas demanding specialized knowledge like tax preparation or investment management. To put this philosophy into action, begin by identifying tasks that consume excessive time or induce stress, then assess if they can be effectively delegated to individuals with greater proficiency. By doing so, you not only streamline your time management, but also ensure the successful execution of these vital financial activities.
In summary, Warren Buffett's insights offer a comprehensive roadmap for the prudent management of our financial assets. While incorporating these principles into our daily financial routines may initially progress at a gradual pace, it is crucial to sustain unwavering consistency throughout the journey. It's important to adopt the mindset that achieving financial security is an ongoing process rather than a fixed destination. It resembles a marathon more than a sprint. Thus, embracing the wisdom of Warren Buffett assures a path toward a future characterized by financial stability. The question remains, what will be your initial step? If you found this content informative, please consider liking, sharing, and subscribing to our channel. Stay tuned for more enlightening material as we embark together on this journey towards financial awareness and empowerment. We appreciate your decision to join us on this path.